Welcome back to Katie Quiz, brought to you by GBU Life. It is now time for a round we call the Knowledge Check. In this round, each team receives five general questions. There's no rhyme or reason to these questions that we have coming up. We award 20 points for a correct answer. However, any incorrect answer or any passes in this round come with a 20-point deduction. First up will be our team from Quaker Valley High School. And Quaker Valley, before we get to your questions, of course, we want to meet the team. Hi, I'm William Musial, and I'm a senior at Quaker Valley High School. Outside of Katie Quiz, I'm a member of the cross country team and the QB student GSA. Besides that, I'm an editor for the school newspaper, and I perform in the musical and the QB vocal ensemble. Hi, my name is Oliver Graham. I'm a senior here at Quaker Valley. Other than Katie Quiz, I'm a participant in the cross country team and the track team. Hi, I'm Graham G. Notice. I'm a senior at Quaker Valley. Besides, I'm a member of the cross country and tennis captain of the History Bowl. Uh, here's our supervisor, Mr. Matt Welch. She's a math teacher here at Quaker Valley, and he's been coaching the hometown high Q slash Katie Quiz team for about 20 years. Quaker Valley, it's great to have you here on the show. And here we go with your first knowledge check question. This prehistoric monument was built around 4,500 years ago. In what country was it constructed? England. England, we would have accepted Britain or the United Kingdom as well. What is the name for long members of steel or concrete driven into the ground to carry a vertical load? Rebar. Nice try. Piles was the answer we were looking for on that one. Which bird with a two word name was added to the list of threatened species by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service in 2022 under the Endangered Species Act? Emperor Penguin. Emperor Penguin is. What if masterpieces were repainted in 8-bit? Name the 20th century painting by Edvard Munch. The Scream. The Scream is correct. How many cubes are in this picture? Forty. Oh, nice try. Forty was close, but fifty was the answer we were looking for on that one. You got three right in that round. You missed on two, and that takes your score to 145 points. You're still doing great, Quaker Valley. Next up is our team from Sharpsville High School. Of course, before we get to your knowledge check questions, we want to meet you as well. Hi, I'm Nico Petrelli. I'm a sophomore from Sharpsville. I do soccer, track, and quiz bowl. All right, and my name is Max Bain. I'm a sophomore at Sharpsville, and I am the king of the quiz bowl team. Hi, my name is Caleb Rogers. I'm a senior at Sharpsville. I'm president of our Spanish club, vice president of our quiz bowl team, vice president of student council, vice president of natural helpers um, on, on our wrestling team, track team, and in the marching band. And this is our advisor, Mr. Marino. Sharpsville, it's always great to have you here on the show. And here we go with your first knowledge check question. What sculpture collection depicts the warriors of the first Chinese emperor? Sing Army. The Terracotta Army was what we were looking for on that one. Name the musical instrument. Baronet. Baronet is correct. After 20 years in a captive breeding program, Diego returned to the San Diego Zoo, having fathered over 800 offspring. Now over 100 years old in well-deserved retirement, he's the patriarch of what endangered animal? A Galapagos tortoise. Galapagos tortoise is the correct answer. Nicely done. What if masterpieces were repainted in 8-bit? Name the 20th century artist who painted Les Demoiselles d'Avignon. Leonardo. Nice try, Picasso was the answer we were looking for on that one. And we're gonna ask you this, how many cubes are in this picture? 20. 20 is correct. With that, you also got three correct. You missed on two. That means you netted 20 points in that round, taking your score up to 95 points. And next up, we have our team from Chartiers Houston. And Chartiers Houston, before we get to your questions, of course, we want to meet you as well. 
My name is Emily Johnston, and I'm a junior at Churchers Houston. I'm a member of marching band, concert band, and jazz band. I'm the junior class treasurer in the National Honor Society and athletes. Hi, my name is Alicia Coulson, and I'm a senior here at Sharkers Houston. I participate in many clubs here, including Leo Club and National Honor Society. I'm also a track and field captain and a 40 member of the varsity volleyball team. Hi, my name is Alex Weiss. I'm a senior here at Chargers Houston. I'm in multiple clubs such as FBLA, Leo Club, Dreamers Club, NHS, and the Fly Fishing Club. I'm one of our soccer captains, and I'm the drum major for our marching band. And here is our uh, K-12 gifted support teacher, Ms. Drylack. Chartiers Houston, it's great to have you here today. And now it's time for your knowledge check round. And here we go with your first question. Frank Lloyd Wright designed the Imperial Hotel, the only building to survive the 1923 earthquake in what far eastern capital city? Boston. Boston, uh, Tokyo was what we were looking for on that one. You are a framing carpenter and need to mark 40 feet straight line on the subflooring. What very inexpensive tool is a best choice for this task? Chalk line. Chalk line is correct. Name this musical instrument. French horn. French horn is correct. What if masterpieces were repainted in 8-bit? Name the 19th century artist who painted Cafe Terrace at night in 1888. Van Gogh. Van Gogh is correct. Very nicely done. And we want you to name how many or tell us how many cubes are in this picture. Ten. 10 is correct. With that, you got four correct. You only missed on one in this round. Very nicely done. That means you net 60 points, taking your score up to 85. You're still in third place, but things here got real, real close. In second place, we have Sharpsville with 95 points, and still leading is Quaker Valley with 145 on the board. And we're going to speed things up with a lot of points up for grabs in the Katie Quiz speed round coming up next. <laughs> 